Yeah, you know, it's tough. We, I felt like the whole game we were just trying to get that break. You know, it was always going to be if we could get that first one, um, then the game becomes more real. Um, and we just couldn't catch that break to get that first goal. So that's disappointing. Going forward, we've got to find a way to make plays in the box and get on the end of things. Um, I don't know if it's anything great they did. Obviously, they have really, really good players. But again, it's just uh, I think we're, we're leaving this game looking at ourselves not quite being sharp enough um, in both boxes. Right now, it's hard to see all the positives. I'm sure when we step, step back from it in a few days or a few weeks, whatever it might be for certain guys, um, you'll see what big strides we really did make because um, there were a lot of question marks going into the season, and uh, I think we answered a lot of them. We made history with the club, being that club is three years old in the franchise of the MLS, but still, to make it to the final it's in the Western Conference final has been amazing compared to the teams which like Salt Lake, like Kansas, they have been in the run. And my congratulations to Real Salt Lake. And uh, But we'll be coming back stronger next year and we'll push again to make it to the final and this time all the way to the MLS Cup. So we take a knock today, but that should be our motivation for next season. It's a winning culture, uh, no doubt about it. That's one of the things we talked about afterwards is we're, we're proud of, you know, um, we're no longer the Portland Timbers that everybody beats up on. Um, now we're starting to become an elite team in this league. Um, we have to do it consistently. So consistently, um, we'll find ourselves in, in championship games uh, year after year if we continue to have that hunger and desire. And for me, this just makes us hungrier, uh, if that's possible. So it's a, it's a good group of guys. Um, we're competitive. Uh, this fan base deserves a competitive team, a team that fights and gives everything. Um, our effort was fantastic tonight. Um, you know, we just need a bit more quality. We all love the crowd. Every home game sold out for the past three years. That's in Brownville. So all thanks to them, and they have been phenomenal from the beginning to the end, all through the 90 minutes, and we love them for that. And every time we step on the pitch, it gives a wonderful feeling, you know, that you have a crowd like this. So for us, I would like to thank them for a wonderful season. Sad that we didn't make it to the MLS Cup final, but still, we have many more years to come and we'll definitely get one. Oh, that was great because uh, the supporters always with us, uh, they, they are great. And uh, I think uh, we tried to, to make history, but we couldn't and we are sad for, for them. And they, they deserve everything because Really, they are they're great. It's it's incredible that you never. Uh, I say this every time, but they uh, never cease to amaze you. They, uh, I think that's the loudest I've ever heard the, the PTFC, and uh, just brings a lot of emotions because us for players, at the end of the day, we want we want them to go home happy. But uh, I want to thank them. You know, every game they make it special for us, and, and tonight was no different. That was that was amazing. Uh, it was, uh, <clears throat> you know, it just makes you proud to, to be a part of, of something like that. Uh, it's you know, not everybody gets to be a part of something like that in their life, and uh, just makes me proud. I know the rest of the guys. It's it's uh, it's just fantastic to 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 be supported in that way because um, that's rare. I think uh, even in you know all over the world, I think that's rare. Um, so it was, it was a it was a lift to us, and and uh, you know definitely you know, we're disappointed, but it, it, it also is you know that's a light uh, in the darkness there. Yeah, it's amazing. I mean, that's what you expect from them. They're with us through thick and thin. Um, they've been with us now for you know with a lot of the guys for three years. You know, it's been been awesome. Um, it just gives you gives you chills. It's it's why we try so hard, um, uh, you know, and maybe try too hard at times to the point where we, we get in our own way, but um, they're amazing. Can't say enough about them.